Okay, man, I'm ready. Am I recording? Yes, good. Let's do uh, nine attack. I'm gonna quick save it because I don't know. It feels like it feels like these reinforcements are coming and they should not be. But I'm gonna I'm gonna load up the battle and make sure that's not actually what's happening because it can't be right. That wouldn't make any sense. That is not the game mechanic. They're in a fort. This is, uh, that's interesting. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if they just sally out and attack. Uh, like big armies that think they're more powerful than your army ten tend to do that. They shouldn't get reinforcements. I don't see why they would. But we'll see. We have a lot of cavalry. So actually, kind of, I kind of hope they come out and, uh, and sally because... Uh, it'll be much easier to pick them apart. They're, like, their general may run out first and get himself killed. Stuff like that. Let's, uh, let's set up as if they are going to do that for sure. Run shield pikes. Putting my weakest Run units in the middle. I wish, uh, Run does this work? No. I wish it worked in, like it does in Warhammer, where if you drag Sons a unit card around, it'll, like, actually change the positioning of the unit. Off. But but Rome 2's like selection for stuff like their command and control like quality of life features kind of kind of blow. Um, I mean like it, that's not very fair to it because like this is a big step up. Like Rome 2's command interface is way better than like Shogun 2's honestly. Um, for the most part, but. I don't know. It's not as good as like Warhammer. So like you you go and play like Warhammer two now, and you're just like, what is what is this? Missile infantry at your command. <sighs> I'm like your in a constant state of stress right now because you know I, I just we could die any any moment. Missile infantry one one ready. mistake and it's over. Hades can wait. Battle group ready. Levy. Good old melee cab. I, I love this though. This is great. So our general doesn't have to directly expose himself right this second. He can he can wait a little bit this time. He he had to be really active in the last fight, uh, and he only took 20 casualties. So I mean that's pretty good. Pretty good. Not bad at all. Let's go ahead and put all of our peltists and such on the right flank for now. Uh, and I'm going to put Attack! my archers here Orders and just back many. them up with some light infantry, I guess. Or do I want these separate? Or what do I want to do with these? Missile infantry. I'm, I'm probably just going to do something like this. Just just have this as a kind of spare unit. That's, that's all they really are, to be honest. You guys can be over there. Uh, pike formation active. There's no reason not to have pikes up right now. And let's see what they do. As I said, I would not be shocked if they just come out. And it looks like that's what they're going to go for. I'm okay with this. Uh, let's move up. Quickly, because the general is exposing himself. So, he, he he's just going to leave his infantry behind, hopefully. I've seen them do that. I'll be very happy if that is what they do. This is great because this is like the least organized the army could make themselves. I don't hear any notifications about uh about uh reinforcements coming. That's that's something I like to I like to hear or I like to not hear rather. Look at this cavalry unit suiciding itself. You idiots! Idiots! There they go. T turn fire at will off. Don't shoot my own men, please. Those are dead. Easy peasy. Are they going to do the same thing over here? No, they're just going to move infantry out to do that. Don't do that. That's dumb. Yeah, that unit is so damaged, it's basically worthless now. Archers do go fire at will now. Uh, take pot shots if they come back. Let's move my infantry spare unit over here. Uh, I think they'll be better served that way. And let's do some moves here too. Shield pikes! Pikeman! Levy! 
What are you doing? No, no, just just let them do that. Volley. Goodbye. Yeah, no more. Don't waste any more ammunition on them. They're dead. If they charge you, that's fine. Um, kind of exposed missile units there. Now they do have some missile units, so I have to think about that a little bit. Uh, depending on how many, it, like if they start shooting, they haven't even started shooting my uh, pikemen yet. I like that. I'm okay with it. It's like a big, like a uh, muscle battle. You know, we're trying to flex at each other, but they're they're not flexing as well as I am right now. I want to provoke a reaction. I need them to to do something else. I don't like how much they're forming up right now, and they're they're getting themselves in very good order. Um, I don't love that. I, I need to like trigger them to do something. Looks like they're gonna target my cab over here, huh? I don't see any icons indicate. Oh, here we go. Now they're shooting. I'm not sure who's doing that. I don't have uh, missile trails turned on. Probably these Kestros, maybe some Achinchi. Achinchi slingers, yeah. I could just send my cab directly into their faces. And I'm, I'm thinking about it. Okay, here comes the their push. So this push is very weirdly weighted, and it's gonna... I'm gonna move my pikes forward into it. Um, it's going to force most of my missile lines to run away, which I'm not a huge fan of. Uh, it means like this whole half of the army is going to get the flank on us. So I'm just going to maybe do a pike wall, pike box, new box. If they split up in the, in the ways that I'm hoping they'll split up, we'll be able to take advantage of that uh, pretty well and get a lot of surround attacks and stuff off, but... Uh, you know, there's also the chance that they, they won't do what I, how, how I want them to do it. Let's go kill this unit. We should be able to just javelin it to death easy. Three shots into the back of the Prince of Bays. I like that. Yeah, that unit will die. It is important to kill their skirmishers here. Wow, they suicided general into the into the pikes. I like it. Keep doing that. Do stuff like that, please. This is why we do our kink step. Our, our weird line formation we're doing here. These guys are around the side. They're about to get piked in the side. Mistake on their part. All right, here comes the infantry push. Oh, what do I want my archers on? Get on those. Battle ready and eager! gonna have my uh, light infantry here i might actually just mm, i don't know let's just stay calm let them come into us Yikes. that's not good i mean if that's all they come in with we can deal with that the salient cavalry mm -hmm. we could maybe go back and snipe their general let's do it yes commander yeah, I think we have a good opportunity here to snipe their general. So I'm going to try. And they're going to completely expose their backsides over here on the left flank. Where is my spare unit? Yeah, you guys, I, I actually just need you to tie some people up for me. That is honestly the most important thing right now. Just that they can't have freedom of movement everywhere they want. That would be very ideal right now. This unit here is going to get crushed. If I don't do something fast. No, no, no. Don't go in. Don't go in. Stop him. Hey, now your turn. Pull out. Archers, archers, archers. Get the... No, no, no. Those aren't worthwhile anymore. Uh, ooh, I don't know what I want my archers for. They don't have much ammo. We'll just save it. You, on the other hand... I'm going to pause it. Actually, uh, three toggle skirmish. I want you guys around. And take a bit for you to execute some of these orders, but that's okay. I don't know who all I moved. Did I move you yet? Is that your order? No, that's your order. Okay. Let's start getting those around the side. That general is going to get massacred. 
Yes, 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 yes. Good, good, good. If the AI was smart here, they would just turn around their Principes. Uh, because they could easily slaughter this calf. There goes the general. Hopefully we get the kill. I would love to get the kill. That's not as important, perhaps, as uh, just, just getting this unit off the field. So we'll do that. Free shots into the back of these Principes. May win us the right flank. I'd be happy to see it. Here we go, here we go. Here's some free shots we can get into a flank with my archers. We will use that. Your turn now. Looks like we're not going to get the kill. We got Triari coming. Yes. Good, good, good. Excellent. Alright, we have free reign over the battlefield now. Look at the pike line, though. Our poor, poor pike line has just taken so much abuse. So much abuse. I need, like, everyone to target everything. Not you. Not yet. Turn off guard mode, though, because I will need you in melee soon. Okay, Lancers, get out of there. I need you to do more useful things. Every flanking charge we could ever want is available to us, so... Uh, if our infantry line can hold for just a bit, we'll be okay. Uh, we'll at least, you know, survive the battle. General, Bertos, ready and waiting. Swift melee cavalry. There's a juicy target. The Triari here is trying to just, you know, stop them from, stop us from doing this, but uh, they're gonna struggle with that. And this this left flank looks uh, has some issues, you know. I mean, I'm gonna lose uh, lancers like this, but. We're also going to get some kills. Let's do it. Come on. Kill those before the Triari get there, please. Possibly. Not quite, but that's okay. That's fine. Okay, you javelins. I need you to hold those off. Going to lose a pike there. Going to lose a pike there. It is what it is. Orders understood. Your orders. We can't the win at everything. Those the salians are starting to go down. Finish this off. They were they were pretty hurt. Yeah, I just I just want you guys to hold those tree already down. Better target. Juicy target right there. Go in there. Does everyone have some kind of useful order? Getting there. That goes into my general. Charge into the side of him. Yikes. Come on, Perdicus. Yeah, these lancers are starting to starting to take casualties, but another another crack in the armor. Okay. These guys aren't terrible at melee. They can do melee. So I, I need I need anyone that can provide any kind of support to get anywhere. Just be useful. General taking casualties from the towers. Ugh. Bah. Multiple charges going off. Sorry if I'm not explaining everything right this second. I am trying to focus and not die. Trying to keep my micro working. I'm getting a little nervous about my general here. Rally everyone. I'm not really going to try to directly fight Triari wherever I can. I'm going to go for their Principes. Their Principes are uh, weaker morale-wise by far. Uh, they're not you. Uh, you. The Salian's taking some major casualties. But they're they're going down. They're they're starting to they're starting to feel it, feel the heat. There there they go. So many rear charges. It's an interesting situation here. There you go. Get those get those surrounded and handled, please. This this Triari is a good candidate for uh, a rear charge. 
Pile them. Dog pile them. End them. Ooh. Another good target. Yeah. Army losses should be coming. Yep, there it is. And now their most elite units are just going to route without even a fight. 200 units, they're just going to run. You got to love it. Okay. Oh, man, that's bad. Okay. All right. I can't afford to take casualties. You guys take those towers down. Make sure they're not a problem anymore. Uh, cavalry is going to have to do the mopping. Uh, this is not going to be a perfect mop because plenty of them did get away. Uh, like this. You know, actually, that's not many. Oh. Another scrap. Just scrapping constantly. Look at this poor pike line. They got nothing. It's rough. It's rough, it's rough, it's rough. It's rough. Coarse and gritty, and it gets everywhere. Kill as many of these fleeing men as we can. Unfortunately, we're gonna get take some shots here from the towers. Not much you can do about that. Um, I kind of don't want my general to take more casualties though, so let's let's get him out of there. It's really annoying. Some of those uh, towers are killing these. I it may not be worth it to bring them in there. And in fact, yeah, let's just let's just get out of here. Close victory. Yeah. Yeah, that was a bad one. That was rough. It was a much tougher army. Uh, they had, you know, a whole complement of units, but they didn't have cav. They did not have cav. They had a lot more range, and that range uh, certainly cost us. Um, the towers cost us by, it looks like, about 100 kills, potentially. Now, will this be enough to take on uh, their garrison? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> This is 17 minutes, so I can probably, once we get back on the campaign map, we can probably do another battle. We shall see. See you there. All right. Loading is happening now. Yep, not a complete kill. As expected. More money. <laughs> Fund the war effort. Money, 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 money. Man, this is rough. I don't know. Can we even take on <laughs> 15 militia? We hunger for battle. Population, 74% Hellenic. We gotta. We gotta do it. Gotta. No choice. Ooh, they're so... They're so wounded. We so we, we can take Apollonia and hold it for a few turns. We, we maybe have a chance. I'm gonna tax the fuck out of you guys. <laughs> I don't care if you rebel. I don't have time to care, man. Just keep me afloat. I'm not gonna loot this if I take it either. Night attack. This is a lot of beef. They even have a uh, horseman. Okay. Honestly, like this is the best chance I've seen so far at a, at us surviving the campaign. <laughs> it's a it's a Hellenic populace. Like we we can actually potentially replenish troops here. That's that's I I can't describe to you how huge that is if we have a functional army we we can maybe survive uh you know it's still not a surefire shot because you know we're not gonna have the money to fund the army and all the mercenaries that i have and everything but man i got i gotta start you know i gotta try something with an army i can potentially lure people out uh lure their armies out maybe maybe take a a small town somewhere something. Oh, this city. I hate this city. Um, okay. Um, the fighting on this one is all going to be right in the front. 
usually. Look at this. This is so sad. My poor hey, bikes. It's like now. three units left. Come like, on up. Your orders. Oh, it's so bad. Okay. Well, I know they're going to land their boats uh, on the left. Cavalry. So I'm going to put a cav and I think I'll put my light, my light infantry here to deal with those cavalry. landings. Yes, yes. Stop yelling at me. I'm trying to focus. Did not mean to put you there. Uh, you two can be grouped up. You need to be here. You here. Okay. So all of you guys be on the right flank because sometimes they leave gaps there. That will work. Um. Jeez. Just put the archers up front. Put the jabs up front, I think. Put you up front right in case I need you to like come around and help with something. Uh, it really just depends on what they have in the front here. Okay. Moving on. As predicted. Here they are. My general uh, proudly proclaiming that this will be a hunt rather than a battle. Um, maybe for them. <laughs> Not for us. All missile units, get off the fire at will. Positions. I lost my javelin cav in the Hades last battle. It's okay. Uh, they're... Javelin yes, cav is probably my missile least favorite unit to use in the command. entire game. Uh, excluding like Tarantine cavalry. Tarantines are really good. I like those. I'm kind of thinking about just like dumping all of my ammo into the Italian swordsman. I do like the, uh, I like that they have a morale debuff for uh, fighting a night battle. That's cool. That'll make this a little easier. Italian slingers. I'll need to kill those. Hades can wait. Ready. We'll come forward and see if we can tempt them into coming out. Um, I will want to get kills on those slingers. Put you guys on uh, skirmish so you run. You want to be pretty far away from these boats when they land so they don't shoot you from the water because they will do that and then just not, service. you know, land. Loose. Which is a little upsetting when it happens. We're getting shot back, of course. Uh, two archers to one slinger. We should be able to handle that. Okay, I need to get my javelins up front and center as soon as possible uh, because anytime they move sideways like this or back like this, I need to be shooting them in the backs. Okay, now we move up. You kind of want to time this right so that you... Because uh, for a few seconds while they're debarking here, uh, disembarking, they will not be available for attack, but you want to be ready to attack them like right as they become available for attack. I'm kind of worried that these will actually get shot to death while my infantry are still running up to help. See, like I was a little early. A little early. You want to get that charge off. You don't want to just kind of walk into them. And these guys might run left. Uh, that's probably their plan. Uh, if we catch both units, that's fine too. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm okay with that. Uh, we're going to take some casualties on those. That's okay. I'm not worried about it right now. Uh, how are we doing? Doing okay. We're probably getting a lot of our shots absorbed by other units as they run through the uh, slingers. Like, these Italian citizens, are they're basically body blocking for them. A little annoying, but not an unsolvable problem. No, no horsemen left uh, dead so far. That's fine. Good, 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 good. I'm happy to see it. Um, if we beat those... In fact, once these are engaged, those slingers there are completely unprotected. Let's be a little cheeky. Oh, okay. Alright, yep, sometimes the AI uh, snaps, loses its cool, does this. I'm okay with seeing that. Forward into it. Now we 
can get some surrounds off. Let's see if we can catch those slingers, yeah. Kind of sneak past here. They might get stuck in the combat. Hopefully not. Take my eyes off of that for a second while I'm dealing with this. There we go. Okay, now light them up. Archers! Archers still have some ammo. Pull back and then maybe light these up. Oh, I don't like that. Come on, don't do that. Get my cavalry over there. Do something useful. Okay, here we go. That's where they ran. We'll chase them down. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Turn around. Yeah, do it. Do it. Actually, uh, let's go ahead and pull my cavalry through. They don't have good defenses here. Just town guard are not going to beat my my more elite cav cavalry units. Okay, I don't know why you decided to stop skirmishing. I, I ordered a shoot order. I don't recall ordering a stand and fight order. Pretty sure that didn't happen. Gonna go out on a limb and say I did not order that. We're gonna get some beautiful kills on the flank though here with these slingers. Missiles ready and waiting. Your orders. Just pick these guys apart. Missile, missile, every day. It's just Italian citizens, but that's okay. Kills count here. Let's get their morale down. Oh, double charge there. Alright, we yeah, I'm fine with putting all you guys into that fight. It's okay by me. Commander. Come on, kill him. General! Forward! You. The salient cavalry. Is anyone like steady, like not ready to fight? Oh, you're in a good spot for a rear charge. Contests! Archers! Contests! That's a bit better. Yeah, I don't like you guys fighting, but there's not a, gr a great choice there anymore. Whoever can fight has to fight now. Those are shaken. I like it. Those might route. Perfect. Yeah, these town guard are not, you know, they don't have a whole lot of morale. Swift riders at your command. There they go. Beautiful, beautiful. You guys still have ammo? You sure do. Time for some side shots. Some flanking shots. Yes, yes. Fire arrows. Maybe get that unit to route. That'd be nice. I'm kind of thinking about taking one cav and knocking out their morale bonus. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Commander! By your command! For honor and glory. Don't do whatever you're doing. <laughs> just, just go attack something. This unit is so healthy. A unit of uh, Macedonian cavalry. Interesting move here. They're trying to cut through, get out of the way, I think. Fascinating. Don't let them do that. They have to be regretting their life choices right now. Gotta be. This is uh, bad news for them. They're surrounded on all sides. Oh, this nut has to crack. Once their morale bonus goes goes away, I think they'll just crack right away. We'll, uh, we'll take whatever losses we have to in the meantime. Uh, yeah, that, that should be it. Army losses should be coming. Any second now. You guys are taking a coon's age to do this. Come on, go, go, go. There you go. Pretty good. Pretty good heroic victory. 235 losses to 2,198 kills. Ah, oh, man.
I wonder if the the Roman uh, the two armies they have out there are just immediately gonna attack the city or like where they're gonna go or what they're gonna do. I mean, I'll probably have to like go out and kill them. Whew. How long is the recording now? Thirty minutes. I mean, that's pretty good. All right, I will see you guys on the campaign map. All right, eat it. <laughs> and honor. Screw you, Rome. <laughs> Occupy. We hunger for battle. Please, God in heaven, <laughs> tell me that I will be able to replenish my troops. Please. Please, please, please. Kind of tempted to keep that for the garrison alone, but I will take money. Oh, man. Okay. 74% Hellenic, and there are no fucking populace here. Yay! Thank you, population. That makes perfect sense. 74% Hellenic. There are no citizens. There's no one that you could recruit out of these 24,000 Greeks that could possibly fill your ranks up. Okay, I guess we lose anyways. That's really annoying. I really, really, really don't like how that works in, in this mod. Commander. Uh, okay. Let's end the turn. I, d I don't understand that. I really don't. I was, uh, I was pretty hopeful I would be able to, you know, I don't know, replenish my troops. That would have been cool. But no, no, the population is now immediately fourth class Romans. Epirus and uh, the RDA must be thirsty. Must be really angry right now. Well, I'm pretty sure I'm back to having zero options. And unless somehow something changes and the 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 population mod goes, hey, this this the city is 74% your culture. Maybe some of the populace should flip over to your culture, possibly. And unless it does that. Can you not see? Yeah, what the hell. Whatever. Go for it. Syracuse fell to the Carthaginians. Maybe it's because the Romans are so, so horny <laughs> to take... To, to fight me. Maybe that could be why, huh? You think? Ready for orders. This is fucking ridiculous. Ready for battle. Plus zero per turn. Yeah, okay. Where are they going? I see we have settlers now. So, so maybe that's how the game is kind of uh, how the mod is adjusting for the population versus the uh, the units here. Like maybe they're going okay. Like the, the it's it's seventy five percent Hellenic. So now we're gonna have like settlers come in. That that could be what's happening there. Um, At your command. I'm just gonna sit. Ready for battle. I can't even, yeah, because these count as my faction, so I'm not allowed to have those, because of course. Ready for I mean, the thing is, like, as soon as we have anyone, uh, like, ready to, 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 At to replenish, command. we're we're immediately gonna lose them. Every time. I don't know. Uh, of course, I could untax, and that would probably help with some of the growth. Barely. Doesn't change the settler settler situation. Ready for battle. I don't know, guys. I do not have the answers. Where's my spy? Dealing with this bullcrap. We hunger for battle. <laughs> I sneak in and take Sparta. <laughs> Clearly, that that is 
my my only hope, Obi Wan. Nope, not gonna be able to do that. I mean, that's 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 this is really true to character for Sparta, right? Having a robust garrison and a and a king at home and one out in the field. That's your command. <sighs> You are welcome. Oh, I do not think our people. <laughs> Everyone hates me. Oh, my fucking. Uh, the people that hate Rome hate me for releasing troops of Rome after beating them more than they. Mm, Minus 22 for releasing troops of Rome, but 11 and 7 for actually killing them. Are you fucking stupid? What the fuck is wrong with these diplomacy values? Are you ser are you serious right now? We hunger for battle. Here. To victory! There you go. Do you hate me more now? The fuck is this bullshit, man? Doesn't even make sense. <laughs> Uh, send help. Gonna fucking tilt. No, you would point one percent second fucking second class citizen. Ready for battle. It's, it's just ah, it's just it's 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 the level of bullcrap starting to pile up, you know. We hunger for battle. You know, and I might even lose population to the to the garrison, maybe. I don't know, man. I think we're going to go back to waiting to die uh, next video. I'm I, I don't I'm not going to like actually throw in the towel and say the campaign is over until, you know, Perdiccas dies and, and the army is gone. You know, when that when that happens, I will concede defeat until then. I'm going to cling on because there's there's all kinds of little plays you can do that might win you the day. And I also just don't like giving up. So when I, when I lose, I lose. Um, and I'll probably start a new campaign because this one is very short and I was hoping for like a 50, 60 video series. And next one, I definitely will not be putting the campaign difficulty on hard because I don't want everyone to slap my dick into the dirt constantly. I'll see you next time.